Welcome to the frozen world of our northern winter. It can seem hostile and inhospitable, but if you prepare for conditions, you can enjoy some incredible experiences in a winter wonderland. Winter is a great time of year for enjoying the surreal beauty of nature. It creates an incredible world unlike any other time of year. It also gives us access into places that cannot be reached at other times, or not without extreme difficulty and danger. Snowshoes are great for distributing your weight over a larger surface area, so they keep you up on top of the snow, and that also works on ice. We're gonna be hitting the river canyons of the Lake Superior area for some snowshoe in action. Come on along. Wow, this is incredible. It's amazing that canyons and landscapes like this exist in Minnesota. They're intriguing places that captivate the imagination. Well, we kayak these, these rivers in the spring and summertime, and uh, we just can't leave them alone in the winter, so we come back and we ski them in the wintertime or snowshoe. It's just an amazing experience. You're not gonna see beauty like this unless you actually get on the river. All along the North Shore, you've got this just amazing geology with the precipitous drops and the river and the, and the trees and the wildlife. And you know, you're just uh, always looking for a new challenge. A heavy dose of adventure like this is good for one's physical health and is soothing to the soul. Uh, it renews my spirit and it helps me kind of get reconnected. Biggest thing I like about snowshoeing is, is I like the physical part of it. Awesome workout out here. You just look around and it's so beautiful and you're just concentrated on God's beauty and you're, you're alive and it's everything's just so fresh and new. And the snowshoeing up here is so great because uh, you have the beauty of the lake, the canyons, and there's the kind of whole mystique of the North Shore of Minnesota. And it's just, you can't beat it anywhere else around in this area. It's rewarding to join a group of friends and find a place to explore. Experiences like this can open new opportunities and really create a bond among friends. For safety and learning, it helps to tag along with an experienced group of people. It's just great to share stories and get out here and experience this together. When the terrain becomes dynamic, the level of exertion and the fun definitely become more vigorous. What a ball leaping into deep snow banks. Feels good to get out of the wind a bit. Here's the river. Wow. No open water this time. That looks pretty. No, oh, but you can see it's just yeah, under the through. ice. It's moving. Frozen River Canyons are incredibly interesting and exciting places to explore. You never know what will be around the next corner. Wow, wow, that is sweet. Look at that arch. And look at that drop. Yeah, it's a nice drop. Wow, this is high. It blows your mind to see, you know, the power of a river in the wintertime still living as much as it does in the summertime, basically. It's just that it's covered up in ice. So that adds this other kind of adventurous element of when you're, you know, traveling on that terrain, whether it's on skis or snowshoes, you've got this thundering river down below that you've got open pockets of water where you see all this white water and then you've got all sorts of unique things like these foam sculptures that we saw that I had never ever seen before in my life. Conditions are different from week to week and year to year. With freezing and thawing and ice continually building up, every feature can change little by little. So every visit is like a whole new experience. This is not a difficult environment to enjoy. You just need to be prepared. The right equipment, the right clothing, and as always, exercise and caution go a long way to ensure survival. And of course, fun. That's why we explore these places. You just have dress, dress in layers, and, and uh, if you've got some good clothing and, and you, know, you stay active, well, 40 below actually isn't bad at all. This all contributes to having a positive experience. And these are places to which you want to return. This is the only time of the year that you can actually see this vista because, you know, I've been up on top before, but that's a couple hundred feet above that. 
we come around the corner and there's this huge panoramic vista of Lake Superior that's just steaming because of how cold it is. And you've got a nice arch. What a magnificent view. Here you are standing in a spot that you can do no other time. You know, it's, 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 such, it's such a wonderful feeling to be able to you know, be crossing over the top of this roaring, dynamic, powerful river. You're standing on top of all this volume of water that's roaring underneath your feet and right in the middle of a river on top of a 50-foot waterfalls and uh, it's quite extraordinary. Wow, what a fantastic day. Yeah, no kidding. Life to the Max is brought to you by LifeTouch, photography for a lifetime.